Hello, welcome back to my video. Right, if you still remember last week, uh, I have explained about how to use going to and will. So going to and will both have same meaning. Ya, keduanya punya arti yang sama, yaitu akan. Ya. But they both have different use. Ya, in daily conversation or in writing. Ya, dua-duanya punya uh, perbedaan. Ya dalam penggunaannya dalam percakapan atau pada saat menulis ya so I'm going to make you remember again ya about going to and will so will ya akan jadi will ini digunakan untuk hal-hal yang tidak kita rencanakan sebelumnya atau untuk segala sesuatu yang spontan tidak direncanakan ya. so we can Uh, use will uh, when we are talking about rapid decision. Yeah, for example, if you see uh, someone who has an accident, yeah, you would say, for example, oh, there is a, there is someone who has an accident. I will help him. Yeah, jadi kecelakaan spontan dan tidak terencana. Jadi you you you're going to say. I will. Ya, saya akan membantu dia. Ya, seperti itu. Or, ya, we can also use will when we're uh, talking about offer. Ya, offer. Ya, jadi misalnya kamu ingin membantu seseorang, menawarkan bantuan. Ya, for example, oh, Miss Miss Angela. Ya, she brings a lot of things. So, I will help her. Ya, jadi menawar, ingin menawarkan bantuan. Ya, Miss Angela. Yeah, I will help you with your stuffs. Yeah, for example, uh, we also use will. Yeah, when we are talking about promise. Yeah, for example, um, you have a friend and he has a secret. Yeah, hey, please don't tell the others about my secret. And then you would say. Oh, I won't tell anyone, or I will not tell anyone, yeah, because you promise, yeah. Jadi karena tadi berbicara tentang uh, janji, ya. Jadi uh, kalian menggunakan will juga bisa seperti itu, ya. Yeah. Or uh, you want to refuse something, ya. Yeah. Jadi misalnya kalian ingin juga menolak sesuatu, kalian juga bisa menggunakan will, ya. Yeah. So when we are talking about Uh, something we want to refuse, you can also use will. Yeah, for example, uh, will you come to my party tonight? No, I think I won't come. Yeah. Eh, maukah kamu datang ke pesta aku malam ini? Ah, menurutku aku tidak akan datang. Yeah, I will not or I won't come. Yeah. So that's a refusal. Menolakkan. Yeah. Uh, Berbeda uh, going to ya penggunanya ya yeah, we use going to ya yeah, when we are talking about things or events uh, that we have planned before ya yeah. jadi kita gunakan going to untuk hal-hal yang sudah kita rencanakan sebelumnya jadi tidak terjadi secara spontan ya yeah. jadi untuk hal-hal yang sudah kita uh, susun atau rencanakan sebelumnya atau ya yeah, or the things that are likely to happen ya yeah, atau untuk hal-hal yang bisa diprediksi yang kemungkinannya akan terjadi nah going to ya yeah, for example uh, about your plans that you have planned before ya yeah, for example and then I, I ask you what are you going to do next Monday What are you going to do next Monday? So, for example, you have a plan already. So you would say, "Oh, I think I'm going to go to uh, a movie or movie theater." Yeah. Jadi kalian sudah merencanakannya ya sebelumnya. Jadi kalian menggunakan going to bukan will ya. Yeah. So don't forget. Or uh, about things that are likely to happen ya yeah, atau untuk hal-hal yang bisa diprediksi yang kemungkinan akan terjadi ya contohnya um, oh I see 
the dark clouds on the sky. I think it's going to rain, ya. Yeah? Jadi misalnya kalian melihat uh, awan hitam di langit, jadi kalian sudah bisa sedikit memprediksi ya, mungkin akan hujan, ya. Yeah? So I think it's going to rain. Uh, so it's about prediction, ya, yeah? something that is likely to happen. So we use going to, ya. Yeah? Uh, so far, do you understand? Yeah, have you understood? Yeah, I hope so ya. Yeah. Semoga penjelasan Mr. Damas tadi bisa dimengerti ya untuk semua anak-anak. Okay, thank you very much. Okay, so in today's video, I am also going to explain a little bit about our new lessons today from Happy Campers Book Unit 2. Yeah, lesson 1 until lesson 4 later. Okay, let's see. Yeah. Uh, we are not also going to talk about going to, yeah, we are going to talk about transportations as well, yeah, jadi kita tidak hanya berbicara tentang going to, tapi juga tentang uh, alat-alat transportasi, yeah, for example, car, taxi, bus, subway, train, airplane, boat, helicopter, yeah, which transportations uh, do you use the most, yeah, transportasi mana yang kalian sering gunakan di sini. Yeah. yeah, maybe car, taxi, bus, subway or train ya. Yeah. Airplane ya. Yeah. If you go uh, to other countries or far away places, you're going to use airplane ya, yeah, for example. Yeah, boat, helicopter. These two transportations mode are rarely to be used ya. Yeah. Ini jarang sekali gunakan kapal karena harus melalui laut dia jadi jarang sekali hanya orang-orang tertentu ya misalnya berpindah pulau ya kita menggunakan kapal bisa uh, helikopter is used for certain people right helikopter digunakan untuk orang-orang tertentu ya for example probably officials ya mungkin misalnya pejabat ya yeah. uh, right and then let's complete this song later with the correct words yeah because they are missing and then we'll we're going to you know, complete with the correct sentences later yeah all right let's begin yeah i'm going to play the vocabulary video and i want you to repeat the word that you hear okay Car, say. Car. Taxi, say. Taxi. Bus, say. Bus. Subway, say. Subway. Train, say. Train. Airplane, say. Okay, good. Now, uh, now is your turn to close your book for a while. I want to test your memory whether you still remember these words. Yeah, let's just close. Yeah, close for a while. Yeah, what is that? Yeah, car. Car. That one. It's clear enough. <laughs> Taxi. Taxi. This one. Bus. Bus. Yeah. Subway. Subway. Yeah, what is the difference between train and subway? Subway, kereta bawah tanah ya, jadi beroperasinya di bawah tanah, ya. Yeah. Train is now operating under the ground, ya. Yeah. So, remember that. This one? Train. Train. 
Yep, airplane. Airplane. Boat. Okay, done. Good job. Yeah. All right, let's go further. Yeah, to lesson. Lesson one and two. Let's complete missing words. Okay, take your pencil. Complete with the correct transportation words, yeah? Unit 2. Lessons 1 and 2. On the go. done okay before we complete uh, these missing words let me ask you something now there is a girl here and she holds something on her left hand what is it can you uh, give a closer look yeah she holds a shopping list yeah? so where do you think she's going to go yeah, she's going to go to the store. That's why there is a question here. How are you going to go to the store? Yeah, bagaimana kamu pergi? Kamu akan pergi ke toko, yeah. Now, let's complete now. Uh, is, she, is, she, is, is she going to go by bus? No, she's not yet yeah, because I'm not going to go by bus. And then I'm not going to go by yeah, airplane. I'm not going to go by yeah, subway. I'm not going to go by tr sorry train. And then the store is not very far. Yeah. So is the store close? Yeah, the store is probably close. Yeah, because it's clear here the store is not very far. Tokonya tidak. Tidak sangat jauh, ya. Far, jauh, ya. The opposite of far is close or near, ya. Jadi kemungkinan tokonya tidak jauh atau mungkin dekat, ya. So, how I'm going to go by car, ya. So, how is she going to go by to go to the store? Ya, how is she going to go to the store? Ya. Please answer me. Yeah, she is or she is going to go to the store by car. Yeah, good, good job. Let's check together. Yeah, they are all correct. Yeah, please finish it at home. Yeah. Now let's see uh, the questions here. The grammar pass. How are you going to go? Yeah. How are you? Bagaimana kamu? Yeah, going to go. Akan pergi. Gimana caranya? Naik apa? Itu maksudnya. Yeah. How are you going to go? I'm going to go by car. Saya akan pergi naik mobil. I'm not going to go by bus. Saya tidak akan pergi naik bus. Yeah. 
yeah, so uh, that's the main thing. So why why do I use Indonesian language today? Yeah, so because I understand not everyone can understand English, so that's why I, sometimes I use Indonesian language so that everyone can understand uh, my lessons here. Yeah. Hopefully. Now let's take a look here at the sentences. Talk about plants. Sentences. Kan, itu kalimat. Yeah. Which sentences? Kalimat yang mana? Ini. Yeah. Kalimat yang ini. Yeah. The sentences talk about plants. Kalimat-kalimat tersebut. Ya, yeah, berbicara tentang rencana. Going to kan tentang uh, hal yang berhubungan dengan rencana kan? So, do the sentences talk about plants? Yes! Number two, the sentences talk about the future. Apakah kalimat-kalimat tersebut uh, berbicara tentang masa depan? Ya, yeah, how are you going to go? Bagaimana kamu akan pergi? I'm going to go by car. Saya akan pergi naik mobil. Naik mobilnya kapan? Sekarang. Ya tidak, ya. Nanti dalam setelah per, setelah jadi begini, dia dalam perjalanan menuju mobil. Nanti belum terjadi ya naik mobilnya ya. Jadi do the sentences talk about the future? Kan belum terjadi ya. Baru rencana kan, ya. Yeah. So, yes, they talk about future. Ya, yeah, oke, okay. karena belum terjadi, masih rencana, ya. Yeah. Oke, okay, done. Now, uh, please complete yeah, these two numbers with the correct sentences. Following this pattern ya, lengkapi dua kalimat ini, dua nomor ini dengan kalimat yang benar ya, berdasarkan gambar, sesuai dengan contoh ini ya, based on this example. Okay, I'm going to go by train. Okay, so let's just use I'm going to go or I'm not going to go. Kalau ada silang di sini artinya I'm not ya. Yeah. Number two, how's the sentence? Yeah, I'm not going to go by by what? Apa? Yeah, helicopter. Number three, let's just use I'm again. I'm. Yeah, kalimatnya positif dia bukan negatif ya. I'm going to go by what is the transportation? Yeah, boat. Okay, correct. Good job. Yeah. Please complete these two sentences. Your no in your Happy Campers book, yeah. Okay, we go to the next lessons, lesson three and four. Nah, in this dialogue, yeah. Uh, so we have. Uh, do you still remember their names? Yeah, this girl's name is um, Patty, and then Adam, Jason, and Sue. And this one is. Yeah, Patty's mom. Ya, yeah, please read for a while. Coba tolong dibaca sebentar ya percakapannya. Read the dialogue for a while. Oke. Okay. One minute. Done? Oke, okay, good. Hey, my questions now, ya. Yeah? Before we play the the conversation video. Yeah, let me ask you the questions first. Now, why does she call her friends? Kenapa dia nelfon temennya sih? Kenapa? 
Yeah, yeah. So, so I guess they have planned to have band practice yet. So that's why she calls her friend to ask them whether they are going to have band practice or not. So the first person that she calls is, yeah, Adam. Yeah, she calls Adam. Adam. <laughs> Yeah. Is he going to go to band practice? No, he's not. Why? Yeah, because he's going to. Yeah, where is he? Yeah, he's going to go to the best store to buy a dog food. Yeah. And then, because Adam has another plan, yeah, so. She she calls another person, which who is Jason? Yeah, is Jason going to go to band practice? No, again, yeah. Where is he going to go? Yeah, he's going to go to. Yeah, it's clear. Yeah, bookstore. Oh, poor, poor Patty. Yeah, she goes to the next person. Who is Sue? Yeah. Is she going to go to band practice? Well, it's clear again. Sue can go to the band practice because she has an appointment at the hair salon. Yeah. Well, finally, so she just lays on the sofa. <laughs> dia akhirnya dia memutuskan duduk di sofa ya, yeah? and then suddenly. Her mom comes to her and then asks her, "Yeah, are you going to go to the mall today, Patty? Apakah kamu akan pergi ke mall hari ini, Patty? Yes, I am. No practice today, so I'm going to go play at the arcade. So where is Patty going to go? Yeah, Patty is going to go to the arcade. Yeah, at the mall." Ya, karena sudah kecewa akhirnya. Ya, sudahlah. Enggak jadi latihan, latihan band. Ya sudah pergi ke mall saja, oke? Okay. Ya, tapi ya but after she arrives at the mall, Patty meets her friends. And her three friends are all there. Semua temannya ada di mall. You are all here at the food court. We need to talk. There is a talent show at school. Ya, jadi siapa yang berbohong? Ya, who's lying here? Ya, these three people are lying to Patty. Ya, mungkin tiga orang ini sudah berskongkol untuk janjian di mall. Ya. And Patty doesn't know it. Ya, Patty nggak tahu. Ya, siapa? Yo, yang begitu pernah ya? Who's ever done that? Siapa yang pernah melakukan itu? Ya, pasti ada ya. Yeah, that's not good. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, that's all about the conversation and the dialogue. So you can practice uh, your speaking with this dialogue at home. Yeah, with your brother or sister. Yeah. All right. Now I'm going to play the conversation video. Let's watch it together. Jason, Patty. Adam and Sue, the happy campers, coming to you. Hi, Adam. Are you going to go to band practice? No, I'm not. I'm going to buy dog food at the pet store. Hello? Jason, are you going to go to band practice? No, I'm not. I'm going to go to the bookstore. Hello, Sue. Are you going to go to band practice? I can't. I have an appointment at the hair salon. Are you going to go to the mall today, Patty? Yes, I am. No practice today, so I'm going to go play at the arcade. You're all here.
here at the food court. We need to talk. There's a talent show at school. Jason, Patty, Adam and Sue, the happy campers, coming to you. Yeah, done, yeah? Anyway, there is a lot of... There are a lot of uh, public places in the mall, yeah? Can you mention them? Yeah. The most interesting thing in the mall is probably... Arcade, yeah? What is Arcade? Arcade? Uh, we usually call it time zone. Yeah, <laughs> time zone. You know, time zone. Yeah, it's a place where kids can play. Yeah, can play anything. For example, throwing the basketball into the ring, basketball ring, or or what is that? How do you call that? You use the coins to get the dolls, for example, or play the car car racing or motorcycle racing you play ding dong yeah, and many other interesting and fun games yeah in the arcade now from the dialogue yeah what um public places in the mall that you can identify so what public places in the mall in the mall that you can identify here yeah the first one pet store and then bookstore hair salon yeah and then food car yeah so they are located yeah in the mall yeah sometimes you can also find pet store yeah kadang kadang di mall tu ada ya pet store ya ada kadang kadang but not all malls have pet store okay good now let's complete now yeah, what is this oh wait I forgot I forgot this one oh, what is that what place is it yes hair salon oh yeah anyway hair salon is for women yeah salon Hair salon itu salon untuk wanita. Ya. Men can go to barber shop, ya. Kalau untuk pria namanya barber shop, ya. Jadi hair salon itu salon untuk pria, eh salon untuk wanita, ya. Barber shop itu salon untuk pria. And that one? Ya, pet store. Pet store. This one. Mall. Mall. Yeah, you can see any games, yeah? Fun, interesting games here. Arcade. Arcade. Bookstore. Bookstore. The last one. The place you can eat. On oh, the place you can eat. The place where you can eat, yeah? Food court. Food court. Food court. Okay, now let's do this one. Dictation. Let's write the sentences based on the audio. Unit 2. Lesson 3. Activity 3. Dictation. Listen and write. Then say. 1. I'm not going to go to the bookstore. I'm not... Two, I'm going to go to the arcade in the mall. Three, the hair salon is next to the pet store. Four, are you going to go to the food court? Are you? Okay, let's do it one more time. 
Unit 2, Lesson 3, Activity 3, Dictation. Listen and write, then say. 1. I'm not going to go to the bookstore. Voice number 1. I'm not going to go yeah, to the bookstore. You can say bookstore or bookshop, you know, they're just the same. 2. I'm going to go to the arcade in the mall. What is that? I'm going to go to the arcade in the mall. 3. The hair salon is next to the pet store. The hair salon, yes, good, is next to the pet store. Next to the sebelah ya. Salonnya ada di sebelah pet store. Itu maksudnya ya. 4. Are you going to go to the food court? Are you going to go to the food court? Yes. <gasps> What's wrong here? I'm going to go to the arcade. Food court. Oh yeah, it's with space. I'm going to go to the arcade in the mall. Wait, wait, wait. I forgot. Then say one, two. I'm going to go to the arcade in the mall. Oh yeah, I'm going to go to the arcade in the mall. Sorry, I forgot. Yeah, now it's correct. All answers are correct. Good job, everyone. Okay, I'm going to close it. Now let's answer uh, these yes or no questions, yeah. Uh, let's ask Patty, yeah. Patty, are you going to go to the mall? Now, is Patty going to go to the mall? Do you still remember? Yes, yeah. Yes, I am. Okay, number two, let's ask Jason. Jason, are you going to go to the hair salon? Is Jason going to go to the hair salon? No, yeah. Jason is going to go to the bookstore, yeah? So, no, I'm not. Now, let's ask Adam. Adam, are you going to go to the pet store? Yes, yeah. Adam is going to go to the pet store. So, yeah. Yes, I am. Okay, correct. Okay, the last one, yeah. I could be a cheer. Ready? Okay. Are you going to go to the pet store? Yes, I am. Yes, I am. Are you going to go by train? Okay, guys. Alright, I have finished explaining Unit 1, sorry, Unit 2, Lesson 1 until Lesson 4, yeah? So, what have you learned today? Yeah, today we learned about first, right, going to and second, yeah, transportation words. And third, yeah, we also learned about some public places in the mall, yeah, such as bookstore, arcade, pet store, food court, and then, yeah, hair salon, yeah, and uh, we will also learn about 
other public places in the mall and other transportation words next time yeah on the next video and the last i would like to say thank you very much for everyone who has listened to my video and thank you for your attention today and i'll see you on the next video goodbye thank you very much